camping out under the stars to get prime position for the screening of the new Harry Potter film. Thousands of fans are roughing it in Trafalgar Square despite the changeable climate. Been here about 72, 72 hours. We've been counting down somewhere. And I'm sunburned from Monday and Tuesday when it was really hot. And now I'm absolutely soaked from when it rained last night. So, English weather. But some have come a very long way for that very British summer. Soy Sabrina, de Argentina. My name is Sabrina and I've come from Argentina, Buenos from Aires, Buenos Aires, 12,000 kilometres to see para ver a Harry Potter. The devotees come from a whole generation worldwide who grew up at the same time as their hero. Daniel Radcliffe was 11 when the first instalment came out in 2001. Today, he's a young man of 21. I also miss getting to do some of the stuff that I get to do as Harry. You know, I mean, there's... there's, I, I mean, I'm not naturally, I don't think, I don't really have the natural frame and stature of, a, of an action hero, so it's kind of a gift for a young actor to be able to do all that stuff. And Warner Brothers will miss their hero too. In 10 years, the saga has taken in nearly 4.5 billion euros, with more to come. The final instalment about to be released in 3D is expected to set new box office records.